What's up guys, Andrew's Crypt coming at you guys today with a brand new video. Today's video is going to be a little bit of a collection update of some of the things I picked up in the last few weeks. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Uh, first thing I got here is actually going to be a t-shirt. This is something I was gifted for my birthday and it came from, uh, um, sorry, Fright Rags. It is the Munsters here. So this is part of Broad Zombies, Munsters, um, and Fright Rags did a whole collection of, of the, for the movie, I should say. But yeah, I really dig this. It's got that like black and green tie dye, which I really like. It's just simple. This is the monsters on there, which I don't know about you guys, but I'm I am very excited about the movie. Um, I know a lot of people have their doubts and worries. I'm a little worried in a sense, but for the most part, I am excited about it. I'm a big fan of the monsters, uh, the series. So definitely looking forward to see what Rob Zombie is going to bring to the table with that. I also did have an, uh, another shirt from. Uh, cavity colors actually and it's the cavity colors monster club shirt so it's very similar in terms of color it's got like this uh black and gray tie-dye but then the logo is white and it's like the big pumpkin logo and it goes in the dark it's just actually in the in the laundry right now so i don't have it um but yeah let's go ahead and get into the movies now so my last video i talked about how i was going to be picking up the halloween films in 4k from screen factory i picked up part five first and I did pick up a few others here. So I'll start with, uh, I got part one here. And originally I was gonna get this one last, but I saw it for a good price on Amazon and picked it up. Um, and it is worth the upgrade, even if you guys have the standard 4K release that came out a few years back. Uh, this is actually a newer transfer of the film. It kind of corrects a lot of the, the picture issues. And um, you get the Dolby Video, or Dolby Vision and Dolby Atmos with this as well. So. Uh, in here, so you get the little slip box film itself, which includes the uh, 4K Blu-ray, the standard Blu-ray, and then you also get the Blu-ray with the original Blu-ray color timing, uh, which is kind of neat. As far as special features go, don't really think there's much here new. It's, it's mostly just the new scan, the new Dolby Atmos track uh, that's included in here. Uh, so with that one, I got part two. Um, this is also a new 2021 scan. It uh, also includes the Dolby Atmos and Vision. A little bit closer look at the artwork here. Um, and these do have the reverse art. As you can tell, I've already flipped them around. So it has like the traditional artwork backside. And you get the 4K, the Blu-ray, and then this one actually includes the DVD television cut. Um, which I mean is cool to, to include the extra cuts, but it just to me it seems very unneeded to include a DVD when you're purchasing a 4K. Uh, next up we have Halloween 3, one of my favorites in the franchise, even though Michael Myers isn't included in the film. Really dig the artwork on this one. Uh, same thing here, this is a new 2021 scan. I don't think much of the features are new. Um, it's packed with a lot of features, but I think everything's already been released in the past. Uh, it mostly it's just the new scan. And this one actually does not include the Dolby Atmos track. It looks like it's just the Dolby Vision scan. So uh, we have the original artwork there. There's the back side. And then this just includes the Blu-ray and the 4K. Uh, part four I have not received yet. It is in the mail, it's coming. Um, don't know when, it's kind of back ordered right now, but I do have it on order. Uh, next up we have from Scream Factory as well. This is actually a new release that just came out about I think two weeks ago now. This is the Fun House here. Um, I really love this film. It's a little underrated. It's not for everyone. It's not a gore fest or anything like that, but it is a solid uh, horror flick or kind of creepy fun house vibe film haunted house kind of feel of a film um if you guys have never seen this definitely check it out but i did actually get a chance to watch this and the scan the new scan it looks absolutely amazing i had the previous blu-ray release which looked great too but this really makes those color colors look more vibrant um it doesn't look as grainy the picture quality just looks really really good in this one uh, especially for being a movie that came out you know in the early 80s so Scream Factory actually did a really, really good job with this transfer here. Uh, as far as new features on this, 
I think it's the same other than you get new interviews with the actors, um, Miles Chaffin and Wayne Doba, but I think everything else is about the same. Um, you just get that new 4K scan on here. And you got the reversible art there. There's the back side. And then included is the Blu-ray and the 4K. Uh, next up we have, this is another new release. Um, this came out from Paramount, I think it was. Yeah, Paramount. Uh, this actually just came out last week. This is the Adams Family here, These, the new 4K Steelbook release. So they did release this film on 4K, I wanna say, towards the end of last year, or maybe it was this year. Um, it's been some time, but now that now they're releasing a steelbook for it, and I had the Blu-ray two-pack of the films, so I figured now that there's a steelbook and there's 4K out, it would be a good time to upgrade. Uh, as far as special features go, you just get the introduction with more Mamushka version, uh, filmmaker focus, and archival feature it. So nothing really new there. Uh, here's the artwork on the front the back you get the house there i really like the color of this one's like this purple and then inside you get your digital copy and you can see there's some artwork here you guys could probably hear dr satan running around the house he's going crazy right now <laughs> all right uh next up we got two new releases these are actually uh both came out this week we have the new 4K Steelbook release of The Lost Boys. So this is a Best Buy exclusive here. Um, special features, you get the commentary with the director, additional scenes, a documentary. Um, there's a couple of featurettes, some lost scenes, music video, um, World of Vampires interactive map, theatrical trailer. So here's the artwork there you can see are all hanging off the bridge there in the reflection of his sunglasses in the back there you got the carton inside here you get your digital copy with the blu-ray and the 4k here is some artwork for the inside let me go and pop these discs out so you can see the additional artwork it just kind of falls into that whole room there there you go all right, perfect. So there's the Blu-ray of, or sorry, the 4K Steelbook release of The Lost Boys. I'm, I haven't had a chance to check out the transfer on this yet. I have seen some people talking about it online. It sounds like it's pretty solid. So I'm looking forward to, to seeing that. All right, guys, next up, uh, this is Poltergeist here. This is also the new 4K Steelbook Best Buy exclusive here. Sorry, I feel like it got a little dark here in the lighting. Um, as far as special features on this one, you do get and they're only on the, it looks like, at least, let me double check. I don't know if the special features are only on the Blu-rays. Um, on the Lost Boys one, it says commentary with the director and then also on Blu-ray, additional scenes. This one here, it says special features on Blu-ray, which is, they are here, the real world of Poltergeist documentary in two parts science of the spirits and commute um communing with the dead sorry it's really hard to read in here uh the making of poltergeist and the theatrical trailer so you could see that she is falling into the pool there you can see all the bodies are rising out of the ground and then you got the back side there the tv and inside you get your digital copy there is some additional artwork in here uh best buy exclusive this one actually includes a warning here. It's kind of interesting. It says this film contains sequences of flashing lights that may affect viewers who are susceptible to photosensitive epilepsy or other photosensitivities. Uh, so interesting that they're including that warning in there and it actually includes a little, another little one here. So if you have epilepsy, they may not recommend watching this film. I actually have epilepsy myself and um, I've seen this film plenty of times. It doesn't, those kinds of things don't really trigger me. All right, guys, that is about it uh, for this video. Kind of a quick one today, just a little bit of a collection update of what I've gotten in the last few weeks. I do plan to make another video soon. It's going to be a little different. It's going to be kind of a collection update for pets. Um, there's been a ton of Halloween stuff that's come out this year in pet stores. 
and or normally buy that stuff but now that dr satan's part of the family been went a little overboard and just bought all kinds of stuff for him that it's really really fun and exciting to show so i'm going to talk about that stuff a little bit later and kind of tell you guys what's out there um between like pet smart petco and a few other stores so stay tuned for that anyways guys thank you so much for watching make sure you check out my links below and i'll see you guys in the next video